Shut Hi there. I didn't see you. But now that you're here, you could join me in this unboxing of Japan Crate. Last month's was okay. Okay enough for me to order it again. This month is the Halloween themed edition since it is the month of October. And uh I have it right here. Japan Crate. Halloween edition. It even says Happy Halloween. So if you really want to see what's inside, then stick around. <laughs> Now, it's time to just jump right into it. We're going to jump right into this one because I do have another video to record for uh, the Tokyo Treat box I ordered, which is also Halloween themed. So, we're going to get this out of the way. This is the Japan Crate from, and it's a premium edition, and it's supposed to be Halloween themed, kind of. As you see, happy Halloween. Now. Oh, that one was easy. Good thing I have these nails now. Uh, Japan Crate. I am going to mess up a lot of pronunciations here. I always do. Alright. Let's get our... Handy dandy little cheat sheet or card, whatever you want to call it. Um, ooh, looks like October he could have won a switch and the triple pack for Resident Evil with Resident Evil 4, 5, and 6 in it. Yeah, good luck on that one. I won't ever win any of those crates. <clears throat> All right, so let's go and pull something out, and we'll find out what it is. Mm. Mm. This right here, get the damn thing open. Uh, anyways, this right here. Looks like it's going to be something strawberry shortcake flavored. Um. I believe it says Taken Noko no Sato Strawberry Shortcake. In Japanese means bamboo, bamboo shoot village. And that's exactly what's inside the box. Each chocolate biscuit is a bamboo baby bamboo shoot except way tastier because of strawberry shortcake flavor. Enjoy these creamy and strawberry covered cookie bites. I don't know. Sometimes these things can be questionable for me. Oh dear Lord. Why? Why? Why Disney? This is something I did not ever see, think I would see in here. Something Disney related. But it turns out, if I can even find it. I have this here. And I'm trying to find it on here. Is that it? That might be it. But the weird thing is, it shows it in a package. Like, an actual pack. Not a box. Huh. Anyway, it looks like this is Halloween Disney chocolate character. Character chocolate, I mean. Mickey and friends finish trick-or-treating, and they're sharing their chocolate loot with you. 
enjoy this Halloween Disney character milk chocolate. I believe that's what this is, but on here, it shows it as an actual little pack, like almost like a Reese cup pack. So, I don't know. If that's not it, then I don't know. There's no thing on it for here. Now, this just looks weird. It looks like a cartoon worm or eel. Now, I didn't know eel was candy, of course. It probably really is an eel. This is pronounced... I believe Den Geki or Gekai Hunter Soft Candy. And what may be one of our most unique DIY kits hunt down an eel, cut him up, and pour the sauce on top to make your very own confectionery unagi. Just the right amount of macabre and fun for Halloween. Okay. Again, some of this stuff, I don't know. Now this is adorable. Pika! Pika pee! Okay, so this one is Pokemon Halloween Party Pack Chocolate. Pika Pika! These Halloween edition chocolate puff snacks are shaped like mini Pikachus. They're fun and tasty as is mixed with milk or sprinkled on desserts. Gotta eat them all. So they're chocolate little puffs. That'll be tasty. All right, now. Okay, so I already found this one. This one was easy. Japanese chestnut Mont Blanc caramel corn. I believe is what it says. I mean, it says caramel corn right on the freaking bag. Caramel corn is a JC family favorite, a popular Japanese snack known for its sweet, airy crispiness. This special seasonal flavor is Mont Blanc with Japanese chestnut. The perfect autumn snack since chestnuts are one of Japan's most popular fall treats. Okay. Again, I don't know if I'm going to like some of this stuff. This is definitely got to be a gummy. And judging from the packaging, it's like grape soda flavored, I'm betting. And here it is. Grape Soda Gummy. Introducing Grape Soda in its newest form. Gummy. Chew on this. Tasty gummy dusted in extra flavor crystals for a Halloween night boost. That doesn't tell me if it's going to be sour or too sweet. Let me guess. Gum. Mm-mm. I'm going to go ahead and guess some type of gum. And I was right. Dongori gum or Dongori gum. I don't know how it's really pronounced. Two for one. This soda flavored hard candy doubles as gum. So when you're ready to switch it up, aim for the center for some fun. That's definitely different. Okay. Just, what the holy hell is this? I believe this is going to be this. Yeah, it's got to be this. Alright. This right here, I couldn't even take a guess at what it is. But it has a little witch on the packaging. Looks like it turns your tongue, might turn your tongue different colors because her tongue is like purplish. It's called Halloween Pero Pero 
Compito or Competo, something like that. In Japanese, Pero Pero, or it actually shows the symbolism for it, the writing, is the onomatopoeia for lick. Kanapito or Kanapito is a traditional Japanese sweet of star-shaped sugar candy that is often given as a gift. So I have a feeling it is going to change your tongue color. I have a feeling. But it's some kind of sugary candy. That's all it says, basically. Whoa. This is going to be like sour straws, basically. I, I have a feeling. As you see on the package, it says Fruits Monster. It's called Fruits Monster Rainbow. Not all monsters are scary. This one has a fruity rainbow candy to share with you. Bite into this soft gummy when you have a monstrous craving for something sweet. So I guess it's not going to be sour. So, that's different. Most time I see stuff like this in stores and it's always sour. And I'm not big on sour stuff. Mean sour? Don't get along. Oh. So we have a little packet of Pocky. Now, Pocky comes in many different flavors. But this one, it says, Lovely Halloween Chocolate Pocky. Each Pocky Pack is decorated with a Halloween design. Kick back and relax during your snack break with a classic Japanese snack. So, there you go. Pocky. I know you can find Pocky in stores like Walmart, but you can only find it in chocolate, strawberry, and cookies and cream. And I think now they have the almond crush, crush version or whatever it's called. <clears throat> Now, well, this one was easy to find right off the bat because we're almost out of things here already. This, I uh, believe, this says Nato Umaibo or something like that. I, I have no clue how to pronounce these things. Have you ever wanted to try Nato, a unique Japanese food that people either love or hate? Here's your chance to try it with this Nato flavored. Umai bowl. So which side are you on? I've heard stuff about the natto is nasty. I've heard. Oh, okay. <clears throat> nah, I'm gonna do that a little bit. All right, and this looks like this says for you on it and whatever it says in that language. This is a Halloween chocolate bat. Swing, batter, batter, swing. Swing this chocolate-coated snack right into your mouth for a sweet and satisfying home run. Okay. Seems to be a lot of chocolate in here. What else we got in here? Is that it? So we have three mini things. Or three big things left. Let's go with the smallest one. This looks like it's going to be some kind of gum. Last month's had Pikachu on it, and it was apple-flavored gum, which wasn't too bad. Now let's find you. It looks like it is called Sumiko or Smiko. Kurashi gum. Trick or treat at the home of the Suma Sumiko Sumiko Kurashi cuties. They're giving you this yogurt flavored gum for Halloween. 
yogurt flavored gum. Well, they say, don't knock it till you try it. But. On to the next item. <laughs> That's cute. Looks like it's supposed to be like a strawberry little cupcake or ice cream cone. I think it's supposed to be like a cupcake. Uh, let's find it. Uh, let's find There it is. It, it says... Strawberry soft. It's almost too cute to eat. Which it is kind of cute. This sweet marshmallow type treat is flavored like strawberry shortcake. Now I'm not big on marshmallow, but this ain't that much of a marshmallow, so I think I can handle this. Now, this is going to be kind of different. Already on the packaging, it says Cola Ball. Cola Ball. Did you know Japan loves jelly? There's a variety of jelly candies, desserts, and drinks. Try it out for yourself with this bite of cola-flavored jelly. Now, years ago, I had some jellies that had pieces of fruit in them. They weren't too bad. Don't know if they were supposed to be Japanese, but they were Asian of some sort. That's all I know. But, on to the bigger items. Let's go ahead and do the drink. Milk Lipton Milk Caramel Tea. It says Lipton, Lipton Caramel Milk Tea. Refresh yourself with this limited edition Lip, Lipton Caramel Milk Tea after a long night of trick-or-treating and Halloween festivities. Each bottle features famous collaboration artwork. Now on the website it says this would be good cold or warm. So... I don't know. I'm not big on caramel. But this I'm going to be giving it a try. But don't know. I just don't know. Like I said, these things can be a hit and miss. These kinds of crates. And here's one big thing. And then we will do the last little bonus item last. This is called Peanut Choco Ball Halloween Pack or Choco Ball. It's either Choco Ball or Choco Ball. You can't have Halloween without these classic Japanese chocolates. These milk covered crunchy peanuts are one of those treats you just can't stop munching on. Choco Balls or Choco Balls. I, 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 I always just keep saying it either one or two. Both ways, just in case I get, I don't know. I'm losing my track of thought there. Choco or Choco Balls are a treat loved by all ages to share, so share them. That is, if you can contain your taste buds. Yeah. So it looks like they're basically chocolate flavored peanuts, covered peanuts. Now for the bonus that they put in the Japan crates like every month. Every month. It's a new bonus pack of Kit Kats. And ain't the Kit Kats that you get here in America. These are apple pie flavored. Apple pie Kit Kat. These limited edition Kit Kats are apple pie flavor, but they're also purple. What's going on? Well, the story goes that the ghosts turned the chocolate purple for Halloween. They also made these delicious apple pie Kit Kats the perfect balance of sweet and sour. Now, these I don't think are going to be that sour. They're Kit Kats. How sour can you make Kit Kats, actually? Kit Kats. 
apple pie flavored. So, this month wasn't too bad. But I just don't know if I would eat everything in here. I'm sure I have friends that will help me eat some of this. Friends and family, that is. But I also know there's some stuff I would be greedy about. <laughs> Like the cola ball, the grape flavored gum, grape soda flavored gummy. Well, I'll be greedy about those. But this, I'm definitely probably going to end up sharing with a friend or family. I just don't see me drinking it all. I just don't. <clears throat> just trying to make sure I got everything. All right, good to go. That was the Japan Premium. The edition of Japan Crate. I will put the link to Japan Crate down in the description below. So always remember to hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see future content from me unboxing or whenever I stream games when I get a better connection to stream games because or a better service because Mixer doesn't do that great really. And Twitch isn't good on Xbox either. So. But till then. I'll see you next time. Bye. I don't know why I spun the chair. But bye.